Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Izzy. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I make blackened salmon with uh, tartar sauce. It's so good. The smoky spice rub that I uh, use uh, for my salmon, it's so delicious and so full of flavor. And if you like salmon, you definitely want to check this one out and try it at home. It's really delicious. So let's get started. So we're going to start by grinding our spices. I'm taking peppercorn, thyme, cumin, and just going to grind it up into a powder. Now in a separate bowl, I have some cayenne pepper, smoked pepper, which is very, very important, garlic powder, onion powder, and some salt. And I'm going to add in the ground up spices and mix that together. And this is going to make for a delicious dry rub that I think you can put in pretty much any kind of meat that you're cooking. Now, I have got two salmon fillets, each is a quarter pound. Um, and before you brush it with a little bit of butter like I'm doing here, make sure that it is dry. And just go ahead and generously uh, sprinkle your dry rub on it and pat it down really, really well. Now, I have removed the skin from the salmon because I'm cooking it in a cast iron skillet, which is going to develop a beautiful crust. So I see no reason to keep the skin on. But if you like the skin on, you can keep it on. But your hands are basically going to look like this when you're done. Now, once that is done, get your cast iron skillet ready to go with some melted butter and oil. Now, once the oil is nice and hot and shimmering, we're going to lay down our salmon fillet. And basically, I'm going to sear it three minutes on each side. So after three minutes, I'm going to flip it and then lower the flame um, and then cook it for an additional five minutes until it's nice and flaky. And this, the, I mean the crust, just look at this crust. It's so gorgeous looking. And you can see that it's a little bit charred, which is going to develop such beautiful flavors. <laughs> okay, now on the side I've got some tartar sauce, a very quick tartar sauce, chopped up onions, and some pickle that I chopped up. Technically I'm supposed to be using dough relish, but I ran out, so I decided to improvise and chop up some uh, pickles. And just throw those in into a bowl of mayonnaise, mix it together with a splash of vinegar to bring out the acidity, and a little squeeze of lemon juice uh, to make it extra zesty. And because it's tartar sauce and I really, really love uh, garlic in my sauces, so I'm just chopping um, a clove of garlic and throwing it right in. Season it with salt and pepper and you are ready to go. So everything is on my plate. My salmon, coleslaw, and tartar sauce. So let's do this. This is so delicious. It has a perfect amount of heat. It's not too spicy and it has that smoky flavor from the pepper that's so good. I hope you guys like this video. Please give this video a thumbs up and also please do try this at home. It's really, really delicious. If you like salmon, you like spicier Cajun style salmon, you are going to absolutely, absolutely love this. The tartar sauce, coleslaw and everything. It's a really complete meal. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I upload videos every Wednesday. I also have Facebook and Instagram that I started uh, using recently. and. My food is taking a lot of selfie from Instagram, so you should definitely follow my food. Uh, and with that, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for hanging out with me. I amaze myself sometimes. Well, I hope you guys like this video. Please, please, please try the salmon recipe. It's so, so, so good. Um, it actually, uh, I don't know how to end it. Start with coleslaw, tartar sauce, and salmon. And I totally covered that. But let's get started. Oh, if you, if you. If, uh,